California State University, Los Angeles professor Melina Abdullah. She has a clear message for us. Stop calling the police on black people. She tweeted it out, then she even pinned it. Don't call the police on black people. She repeated it seven times. I don't know if you do that in front of a mirror, and I, I'm not sure what happens, but that was her message. I, I don't, I mean, it, does it matter if she repeats it? I mean, are people not listening? They have fingers plugging their ears. Are they they going to read it only once or not read it unless you write it seven times? Her instructions are pretty clear. You know, don't call the police on black people. Now, she could have used the extra space for facts or statistics to make her point, but like academics uh, of today's world, why do that? Are we not supposed to call the police if black people are in trouble? Are we not supposed to call the police if a black man is being beaten by another black man? Does this mandate apply strictly to black people? What happens if the majority of, like in democratic cities, the majority of the police force, including all the higher ups, all the way up to the mayor, are themselves black? What if the responding officer is black? Oh, I don't know what to do now, because all I've been told is don't call police on black people. And arguably, Abdullah's attitude contains a clear hatred of the police. Ms. Abdullah describes herself as a professor and chair of Pan-African Studies. Oh, this is going to get good. At Cal State Los Angeles. Hashtag Black Lives Matter organizer, Pan-Africanist, hip-hop scholar. Not really sure. I'm not really sure if that works. She's a womanist. A truth teller and a mama. Her Twitter page is exactly what you would expect. A hate-filled racist thread of accusation and activism and stories of black supremacy. Hmm, wait a minute. Black supremacy? Her entire existence seems premised on the idea that blackness is supreme and whiteness is wrong. Wow, that sounds racist. But it also sounds exhausting, doesn't it? Can I just talk to people who are in this boat? Aren't you tired of being outraged by everything? I, I think you're addicted to outrage. And it's really, it's, it's got to be tiring to view every single aspect of life as racist or sexist or transphobic or whatever the phobia is that you are saying that whatever it is, that coffee cup is telling you. For, 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 for Professor uh, Melina Abdullah, make no mistake, this is war. She is fighting a war. Her life is war. And she is teaching our college students exactly how to look at their world.